Hubbard House is hosting its 13th annual Stand Up and Stride Domestic Violence Awareness Walk this month. So joining us now is the CEO of Hubbard House. This is Dr. Gail Patton. We're so excited to have you in studio. Well, thank you for having me and seeing you in person after all this time. Oh it's my great. Gosh, I know. <laughs> right? We've done a lot of Zooms, right? <laughs> yes, but we're we happy have. to have you here. <laughs> And before we get into the event, uh, the, the walk, let's talk about Hubbard House in general. Let mm -hmm. people know what is offered. Well, Hubbard House has been providing services to victims and their families of domestic violence for over 45 years. Mm -hmm. We started as a shelter and then we grew to cover many comprehensive services, you know, like our outreach program. We have advocates at the court. We have advocates co-located with the Department of Children and Family. We have our own outreach center on Beach Boulevard, which is right next to our thrift store. Great place to get oh. deals. Just want to say <laughs> and we also have people that go out into the schools and do prevention okay. work as well and education so and as well as providing community education so if you have a need Hubbard House is here for people and let's say somebody does want the assistance mm -hmm. I mean everything is confidential right I mean they, they're gonna feel safe Right, it's confidential and it's free to survivors. Oh, okay. Yes, so they can call our hotline. That's the easiest way to get in contact with us in order to, you know, find out what we offer and what might best fit their needs. Okay, let's talk about then Stand Up and Stride. <laughs> April 23rd's coming soon. Yes. Um, tell us about it. So April 23rd is our Stand Up and Stride Walk and very excited about it because, you know, we're going to get to be together in person, yes. walking for a great cause and bringing awareness. People always learn more about how they can help survivors. Survivors learn about how they can get help and the community comes together in such a strong show of support mm -hmm. for survivors. So it's at the courthouse. Festivities start at 8 a.m. and the walk starts at 9, but we have a family fun zone. We have entertainment there. I mean, it's just a great time to be out in this beautiful weather, to be together as yes. a community and raise awareness and raise funds for survivors. How can people sign up then? Do they need to register ahead of time or let's say if somebody wants to donate or volunteer, how can they how can they do that? Well, if they want to register for the walk, they can go to hubbardhousewalk.com. Okay. If they want to be involved with Hubbard House in any other way, they can also go to hubbardhouse.org and find out how you can volunteer, how you can donate time, how you can donate other things that we need in shelter, how you can donate money. I mean, we used everything because we do everything we need to for survivors. Yeah, uh, but let's say somebody does hear this right now and they want the help. Mm -hmm. What would you tell them? I would tell them, first of all, you're not alone and that there is somebody to help them. And I would say, call our hotline because you can call anytime, day or night, and you don't even have to give your real name if you don't want okay. to. And you can just call and talk about your situation and we're not there to make you do anything. We're there to help you decide what you need to do and help you look at all your safety options. And give the resources. Exactly. But we've talked in the past before mm -hmm. that if somebody doesn't feel comfortable calling because maybe somebody's in the room, there's another way they can get in touch? Absolutely. They can get through our text line, which we started during the pandemic because of that reason exactly. And we've kept it up because this is the age we're in, right? People yep. are more comfortable texting and, and if that is the way they need to get help, we've pivoted and changed so that people can access us in so many different ways. That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Well, one more time for the website uh, for the walk again. It's HubbardHouseWalk.com. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And HubbardHouse.org if you want more information about right. Hubbard House in general. Well, such a pleasure having you here today. I hope it's a great success. Yes, thank you so much. Get those walking shoes yep. on. <laughs>